Hi friends, Whitney here. Welcome back to my channel, Whitney ERD. It's the new year, so that means I'm starting a strict diet that eliminates all fattening foods, including carrots, potatoes, bananas, and other produce that are loaded with sugar. Psych. How many times have you heard this bad advice from uncredentialed influencers that you need to avoid certain fruits, vegetables, and other plants because of their high content of sugar? Let me make something very clear. Fruit will not make you fat. I'm sorry to use that word because it's so derogatory, but that's the word that these fruitophobic quacks are using. So now let's get back to the scientific jargon. Consuming plants, specifically fruit, is consistently associated with lower rates of diseases like diabetes and obesity. Bloggers who claim that fruit leads to weight gain are pulling this out of their ass. Partame loaded sodas. Yes, some fruits have a large content of natural sugars, the monosaccharides fructose and glucose, but they're also high in components like fiber, vitamins, and phytochemicals, nutrients that are associated with good health and weight management. Any studies suggesting harmful effects of fructose show an association between the consumption of fructose found in sucrose, aka table sugar, or high fructose corn syrup not from actual fruit. When fruit is consumed in its whole form, i.e. an apple versus an apple juice, there is literally no research showing it's harmful to health. As I said before, it's actually just the opposite. One study in adults found that those with the highest consumption of fruit had the lowest rates of developing diabetes or dying from diabetes-related complications. Another study showed that the consumption of whole fruit was associated with a reduced risk of long-term weight gain. Finally, a systematic review of 11 randomized control trials found that the majority of studies showed reductions in body weight as the result of increased fruit consumption. So as you can see, the idea that eating too much or the wrong kind of fruit will make you gain weight is absolutely bananas. Like, 10 bananas a day, bananas. I guarantee you that a few 90 calorie bananas aren't to blame for our obesity crisis. What's more likely the culprit? The loads of added sugar poured into our food supply, or possibly even the artificial sugars tricking our bodies into thinking we're getting calories and leaving us prone to binging later. If you missed my video on artificial sweeteners, be sure to check that out next. Eating several servings of fruit a day is not only not harmful, it's beneficial to our overall health. And that's the sitch. I hope you can enjoy your bananas and grapes and blueberries and whatever other fruit that you love eating in peace. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more evidence-based nutrition information. I'm Whitney. Thanks for watching.